yeah, YouTube. Yeah, man, it's Tevin and I'm making, and yeah, man, I'm just gonna show you how to connect to your Steel Series XL uh, gamepad onto PC. Uh, this is the controller itself. Um, I don't want to waste no time because I know a lot of y'all have got a lot of assets to kick, levels to complete, races to win. So I can feel y'all frustration with this. So uh, what you what you need to get this completed is the the Bluetooth dongle. Uh, mine's the ASUS uh, Bluetooth dongle and a charging cable, which is the I think it's called a USB Type C. Uh, it's preferably for charging like phones like HDC. HTC, Sony, Samsung, uh, my Logitech mouse suits, so what it's preferably for that cable. Uh, but you, you get the drift, you need that cable for this controller. So I'm gonna take things from the PC and get you connected. So let's go. All right, yo, so first things first, you wanna download the Steel Series uh, engine. So I'll be providing you a link in the description. So just download that, install it, uh, make sure you agree and confirm and everything. And once you've done that, make sure to open the application. Uh, so for some of y'all, it should it, it might not look like this. It might do, uh, but don't worry about that. I got you. Uh, that's not the main solution, so don't worry about that. So you know you want to get your controller. Uh, if there's batteries in there, you want to you know take these batteries out. Make sure to turn off the controller because you don't want to zap up your shit. So <laughs> health and safety, guys. Uh, so I'm just gonna go ahead and do that now Right once you've done that you see that pull right in the middle You know and you know that cable I was talking about that type C cable You want to plug that into your PC and make sure you plug the the, the, the uh, Port into the controller, so I'm just gonna go ahead and do that now Once you've done that it should come up with uh, and uh, do you want to update the, uh, the gamepad so just proceed from there don't worry what, what's going on on my screen because I've already installed uh, the controller so you know just proceed press ok agree just go with the steps it may take a couple of minutes to update as well so once you've done that you take out the port just minimize this you won't need this for uh, until later uh, pop out the batteries You know, make sure to turn on the controller, and make sure you plug in your your Bluetooth dongle in your PC. Uh, you can you know access it by doing this. See, I can see that the the controller's found the Bluetooth dongle, but if it hasn't found the the the, the, the Bluetooth dongle, you can just go on Bluetooth, uh, other devices, scan for it. And it should appear on the screen. So hang on. If it doesn't, you can just press the the you know the Wi-Fi button right there. You should you should see the symbol. So just press that. It should appear. Connect it. It's saying it's setting up right now. So you know, done. It should be saying we're done. Once it's done uh, and completed. You sh it should come up as orange showing that the, the controller is completely uh, installed and you're ready to go folks man you're ready to game you're ready to do do this mission so guys give me some feedback let me know if your controller is connected I hope it did and yeah man just happy gaming man uh, enjoy your controller make sure to drop a sub make sure to like uh, if this has worked for you and yeah man guys I'll see you guys in the next video I catch you around